Hey guys, Lieutenant Dan here with a quick update on my airbase flight stand. So a couple nights ago, I had made this flight stand um, by basically super gluing these musical wires to the sides of the airbase. And you know, I kind of got ahead of myself, uh, got, got a little too excited with uh, the end result, and I didn't really think about um, the steps uh, to make it uh, extremely low profile. You know, I was, um, at the time, you know, I was kind of looking at those wires on the, on the side thinking, yeah, you know, it's kind of looks like piping or antennas or something like that. But uh, after sleeping on it, um, I thought, why didn't I uh, use a super small drill bit, which I have, and uh, hook it up to my Dremel and drill holes. And that's what I did. So here's the version two airbase flight stand that uh, in this example holds three fighters to simulate the scrambling. But you can see that I put um, holes in the corners and one uh, right in the middle. And I used like a, I don't know, it's like a 132nd or even smaller, maybe a 164th uh, drill bit. And uh, I really like this. Um, it's really small profile. Um, and what I really like about this uh, being a, it is a flight stand, right? So it's like a permanent flight stand for, uh, let's say, Rome, right? So, uh, you know, you could have, uh, instead of having three flight stands uh, for three aircraft sitting in Italy, um, you can just rest your aircraft on that airbase, which I think is pretty neat. And uh, it uh, solves the, uh, you know, the scrambling, let's say. Not, not really solves, but it kind of brings awareness to the, the scrambling. Um, and, you know, instead of having this... Uh, on every single airbase, uh, that doesn't really make sense. So my thought was, you know, for airbases like that would be in the US or in Canada, I mean, I wouldn't have that there. You know, how many times are you scrambling uh, because of a German attack? Um, or, you know, I would definitely have one, let's say in uh, the UK, uh, maybe Scotland, but for sure UK, uh, definitely one in uh, uh, Germany there. Um, and, um, and then probably, uh, maybe in, well, for sure in Rome and, uh, Calcutta, uh, maybe, uh, Japan and a couple of the islands. I mean, there's just some islands that just really don't see that much action, uh, let alone, uh, hardly any planes, you know, maybe, uh, you know, maybe one in the Carolines or for sure in Philippines, but, um, but anyway, I would just have a couple extra um, with the, let's say six or so that will always be on the on the map, um, but have a couple extra in storage so that if somebody wanted to break one out, um, they could do that. But um, I'm really happy with this uh, version two, um, and I look forward to uh, making about mm, probably about what seven or eight more, and then uh, I'll have them there on the map permanently. All right, so I uh, hope you like the, uh, the update and uh, stay tuned for more magnetization of my pieces.